He's a top restaurateur, celebrity chef. Mark McEwen knows how to make anything taste amazing. And now he's trying to get you moving and eating healthy to promote diabetes prevention. Good morning. Good morning, Dina. Great to be here. So good to see you. This is something that's very uh, close and near and dear to your heart. Your sister was diagnosed My sister with... was diagnosed with diabetes at age six. Uh, yeah. So there was nothing she could do about it. It wasn't diet related or what have you. Right. But we were so used to seeing her every morning, getting her insulin shots. That was just part of the family. Mm -hmm. So today, today we want to talk about, uh, we're, I'm partnering with Sun Life to, we've raised funds and raised awareness for childhood diabetes, childhood obesity, and just good health healthy eating, which is really all you need to do in this world. For every age, That's for right. the uh, Boys and Girls Club of Canada as well. That's right. So take us through one of these recipes that you grew up with and cooking that everybody will like because it's delicious. Well, I didn't grow up with this specific recipe. You didn't. <laughs> but you know what? We, we will now. But it, it, it's very funny. Healthy diet today, exercise integrated into your daily lifestyle, and staying away from processed foods. So, so this is an item that you can prepare at home very inexpensively. We have uh, regular or organic carrots just peeled and roasted, so a okay. little bit of olive oil, salt, pepper into a hot oven, get a little bit of roast on them. How long uh, would that take to roast? I would say 20 minutes, 25 okay. minutes. You Easy. could even do it in a toaster oven if you had to. Avocado, which has really great fats, uh, the, the really healthy fats. Healthy fats. Our dressing is olive oil, white wine, uh, uh, white balsamic, uh, horseradish, salt, pepper, lemon juice, Yum. scallion, and cilantro. So the combination of those with the mustard chicken, which we've done a grain mustard crust on, is so easy to make and it's kids fresh. love it. And you roasted this or you can barbecue or whatever you like, right? Exactly. So now you mentioned organic carrots. It's interesting that I, I recently had somebody tell me that uh, people are eating fewer vegetables and fruits because they feel they can only buy organic. So they're actually doing themselves a disservice. That you're better just getting the fruit and veg in your diet, even if it's not organic, rather than opting for the stuff that's got a lot of uh, process. I, I agree with that. Or, or, organic is, is is really nice if you can if you can manage it and find access to it. Yeah. And and afford it because it is costlier. But le as you say, just doing standard food from the grocery store, doing it fresh, sort of. Uh, cooking market style mm -hmm. is where you want to be with that. And it's all about presentation too. You make it always look so pretty at all of your restaurants. So we're cooking this for 200 people today. Oh, I'll really? I'll be working with a few hockey players and sort of managing that variable. Oh, and they this, have this, this uh, healthy appetites, that's with, with for sure. The Boys and Girls Club. And the interesting thing too is when you eat healthy, you crave more healthy foods. And the opposite is true. The more you know, kind of junk food you eat, the more you crave those. So this is the best way to go about it. Just a clean, a clean lifestyle. Clean lifestyle in terms of how you eat and how you shop. I shop the fresh section in the store. I buy a bag and a half every other day, and that's what we take home, and that's what we eat. We try to stay away from processed food. Yeah, and this, this is a beautifully healthy lunch. What do you snack on when you need a little afternoon snack? What does Mark McEwen snack on? I, I like I like eating celery hearts and, and vegetables and a little dip, in the little fridge. Hummus? A little bit of hummus. Hummus nice. is great. I stay away from sour cream dips. So we, we, we work uh, a, a physically healthy lifestyle at home. And, and what it is we eat every day is exactly this style of food. So this, okay. this is an item we make at the cottage all the time, my wife and I. That'll be our lunch. That'll be our dinner. Hey, where's your cottage at? Georgian Bay. Oh, really? Ready to We're go? at Muskoka this weekend. You can come visit if you'd like. That's a long swim. Yeah, I know. And congrats on another amazing season of Top Chef Canada. You know, I adore you on that show with Thank your you. panel. And congratulations to Renee, the chef who won. For more information, everybody, you can cook up this delicious salad. Check out the recipe, breakfasttelevision.ca. And follow Mark as we do on Twitter at chef underscore Mark McEwen. Here's to a healthy diet and a healthy life. Thank you. Thank you. We'll Dina. be back with more BT right after this.